Hey, how you doing? Um, I don't know. I don't know how I feel. Look at this hair. No makeup, nothing. Just me. So I thought I'd flip you through December and Jan most of January's um, bullet journal. Here it is. Um, some of you will know if you saw on my Instagram, I changed books because I needed something a bit clean for this week and next week. It's getting busier. Back to work next week. Excuse me. And this week, um, I've got a program that I'm in doing. It's a pain program and it goes for 10 weeks, but this is the first week. So sometimes you just need something a bit cleaner to start with. Anyway, hopefully this isn't back to front. Okay, so this is the cover of the book with these dots. It's an ampersand book from Officeworks. Index, I didn't do the whole index, so. Mm. Mm -hmm. I'm just going to give a flip. There's January. I put it too close to the beginning. I should have put it further back, but it was already there. Sorry. Oh. My mood tracker, I can finish that because I'm pretty sure I can know the moods. So this was a self-care thing that I did, I found, and I just changed a few things. It's kind of cute. This is some um, writing from a video. I watch sermons about my word of the year on video, if I can find them on YouTube. Yeah, this is just another thing. This was card, and I cut the flower out of it. Christmas card. I found these, I think I told you, if um, they're just little black and whites, because my print is black and white. The list for December, the last list, I think I showed you that at the time. Another Christmas card. This is from my adopted grandma, this one. Christmas week, I needed a weekly. Um, who I got, pre who we needed to get presents for. Uh, a gift my bestie gave me. Is that more sermon notes? Yeah, more sermon notes there. I added that in. Christmas day. Sorry, 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 sorry. Every time I get on, every time. We're still in December here. This is washi tape I got for Christmas. Figuring out my word of the year. This is, um, most of you, if you've been here a while, welcome back. If you haven't, welcome. I do the overheads at church. So I get the list. Nothing under there. <coughs> Here's my 2020. So this was for word of the year. Oh, sorry. I haven't transferred this over yet. Uh, blessings. I love this page. I love going in and just writing things down. This is from SM Plans on her Facebook group. Lovely lady, SM Plans. This was a, um, what do you call those cards? Artist Trading Card. I'm no artist. But what it is is card, then a napkin, and then a printable, and just the word trust on it. My pedal power. My physio likes me to, every now and then to write down how, if I've pedaled or how many steps I've done. Just so she can keep an eye on it. This is a printable. Um, oh, 
Just some spiritual battle truths. If you see anything you're interested in, leave me a comment and I will um, explain it or let you know. This is uh, vellum that I printed. This is a vellum like journaling card that I was given. You'd remember this. This is one of my dividers. I cut up. Sorry. <sighs> or a pocket. I don't know which. Getting a bit elaborate here. These dividers. Um, these three. So this is Rick Warren's message. This is Joyce Meyer's message. And this is... Peter Chai, Chai, Dan Chai. He's in Indonesia, I think. Printable that I color, cut out and coloured in. More vellum that I printed out. I like the dots. If I want these, I can take them out because they're only clear sticky tapes. So I can take them out. Short day, so I just added a bird. These are Kaiser, Kaiser, Craft, Kaiser Craft stickers. They're a bit thicker, so they will chunk. Uh, nothing I can see there. What's that? That's some more stuff I was doing. Um, here I got my stamps. Um, I think I advertised it on Facebook. I'm not sure. Close to my heart, we're doing a stamp sale for the Australian fires. Now, they're in America, Australia, and Japan. So if you're interested, let me know. I've got a friend that sells them. And they're get, really getting into the planner stuff now. So just let me know. A printable. And that's it. This is where I changed. These are um, fit artist pens. I changed out of this one and I went into exactly the same thing. My pen's in there. So it's stopped up. So more vellum that I printed. My first day in heaven. And then straight into it. So that's my flip for December and January, most of January. Um, I've been thinking about doing a plan with me, but I'll have to sit down and set up a tripod and really do it as I would. It's usually just pen and paper and decorate afterwards. Um, the reason for that is... It gives me more room. If I want to decorate something, I'll just put a bit of washi tape or a small sticker in. But usually it's um, decorate afterwards because I don't need the distractions. <laughs> I need to be able to focus. So I've got two more covers coming hopefully this week or next week. Um, they're covers that I already had. I think you'd remember the one with the full pocket at the back. The lighter coloured one. That's getting cut down to B6. And then I was gifted one. Um, and I asked the person that gifted. It was A5. Can I cut it down? She said it's yours. You do what you like. So that's getting cut down to A5. And two inside pockets put in. No from A5 to B6. So those two are coming soon. Um, I watched a video and I wanted to tell you about it just before I go. I've been babbling for nine minutes. I watched it last night and um, I think it sort of goes with what I try to say. It's Candy K. C-A-N-D-I-K. And it's um, Plan a Piece and the fear of missing out and I really encourage you to go and watch this video if I can find the link and link it down below I will 
but I really encourage you to go watch it. It is a really, really good um, video. It talks about, she's only talking, it's not, she shows her, the outside of her planner, but it's not um, like decoration or anything like that. And she really hits the nail on the head, and I agree totally with her. So if you can, go and watch her. I'll link it down below so you can go have a look. Um, you guys know that I've been here a while that I will, um, advertise another channel if I think that they've got something that I really, um, admire. Um, don't forget to go and have a look at, um, Le Cow or Le Wright. He's got some really nice leathers in at the moment. Well, from what I've seen. So if you're looking for a new TN, he, Diamond will... He will try and do anything you want as a cover. He's very um, good like that. So go and have a look. I've had one of his products and I highly recommend his stuff. So go and have a look at that. That's all I've got for you. Um, I'm trying to hit a 1,000 subscribers, hopefully by my birthday, which is a big ask because I need over 600 more people. So if you know anyone, if you're new here, I'd love you to subscribe. My birthday's in July and I'm 50. So a thousand subscribers for my 50th birthday would be lovely. It helps me because I can do lives on my phone. So if I'm out and about, out stationary shopping or whatever, I can pop straight on live and do one. So please help me get my goal for the year. Um, thank you to all those that comment and thumbs up. I appreciate that. And I, um, another lady I watched, she said, out of all the people that you could watch, you stopped to spend some time with me. And I really appreciate that too. Um, I'm based in Australia, down on that little island down the bottom, you know, the triangle island down the bottom. That's where I'm based. Um, so if you have any questions, let me know. I have a Facebook page, Grace's World. I keep going to say Graceful World because that's what it was. Um, so pop on over to Facebook and join us. Leave me a comment. I always reply. Um, I don't. I hope and pray that no matter how big I get, I will always reply. And I think that's very important. So leave me a comment and we'll have a chat. And I'll talk to you soon. Don't forget to be who you create to be. Bye.